I think it was important that the central marriage, Robert and Cora's marriage, should be a good marriage. I think it's a warm show. It's a, a warm look at that world. This is the one that occupies every whole, single episode, everyone. and I think you're quite right. If that had been, had any sort of different colour to it, I think that colour would have uh, bled Filtered into the whole the rest of it. You are a woman of real substance, and I am lucky enough to call you my wife. So I don't have to give it up? <laughs> you wouldn't have anyway. <laughs> Probably not. I like the idea that Robert had married Cora for her millions in order to save Downton and keep the show on the road and subsequently fell in love with her because it put a slight guilt almost into the relationship on his part. It's not so good for you. <laughs> Don't worry about me, I'm an American. I have gun will travel. Oh, thank God for you. Anyway. I think it was a it felt like a very real marriage to me that it was they were they are solid together but my goodness they've had to work at it Cora although of course she never at any point has any intention of becoming Bricker's mistress she is aware of the fact that he's flirting with her and he fancies her and she enjoys it I've seen you with your family ignored and passed over none of this is any reason I'm glad you're still awake Robert, he suddenly thinks, no, hang on a minute, I really mind this. And Bricker takes one step too far and gets a punch on the nose. You can't be surprised. When you chose to ignore a woman like Cora, you must have known not every man would be as blind as you. <laughs> we were always going to make Edith happy at the end. And I was very keen from early on to have her outrank Mary at the end, so that she finally triumphed and, uh, and Mary would have to give way to her in the pecking order. One of the few things that would really be a driver for, for Mary, which is about class and, mm. and social uh, position, would be, you know, for her sister to, to out, outrank her, it's just really? a delicious <laughs> idea. Well, that's the thing. He is the new Marquis, Bertie. But that's absurd. If Bertie's a Marquis, then Edith... Edith would outrank us all, yes, that's right. <laughs> I think one of the forming moments of Edith was very definitely being jilted at the altar. Edith talks herself into Anthony Strallon. Her grandmother knows it's not a good idea. Strallon knows it's not a good idea. Mm. Edith Strallon knows it's not a good idea. Robert knows it's not a good idea. Uh, and that they're at different stages of their life. We are gathered. I can't do this. What? I can't do it. <laughs> 